Plaza Garibaldi. Located in the city center of Mexico City is the cradle of mariachi ranchero music in Mexico's capital. Originating in Guadalajara, Jalisco, the mariachi genre is an important element in Mexican culture and is sung with pride and passion. Characterized by their broad sombrero hats and elegant suits, a mariachi ensemble includes violins, trumpets, vihuela, guitarron, and guitar. Love songs, patriotic hymns, and often heartbreaking lyrics, ranchero songs will give you goosebumps and can even bring you to tears. The importance and vitality of mariachi music in Mexico and around the world is such that it has been honored by UNESCO as intangible cultural heritage of humanity. Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Chinita Food and Travel. We are at Plaza Garibaldi. I am accompanied by one of my closest friends, Panchito. Hi everyone. Panchito is a singer, he's an actor and a personal trainer. Yeah. And uh, we've been friends for like 10 years, right? More About, or less, yeah. Yeah, more or less 10 years. We used to actually travel a lot together because we were on tour. So we're at a very iconic, legendary spot called Salon Tenampa in the heart of Plaza Garibaldi. And as you can see from the videos, there are probably about 10 mariachi groups outside. So the custom is, you know, if you want to take serenata for your girlfriend, your wife, uh, your lover, your mistress. <laughs> <laughs> People drive by and you can literally hire a mariachi and take them take them with you at any hour of the day. So this spot is known for having all of the Mexican legends, Chavela Vargas, Jose Alfredo Jimenez, Pedro Infante, Javier Solís, La Tariacuri, yeah, Paquita they, de Barrio. They've been coming here for the hundred almost hundred years that Salon Tanampa has existed. So it it was inaugurated in 1925 and uh, right now we're here on a Monday uh, because we do have a gig next door at Salon Tropicana and uh, I actually prefer this, this sort of ambience. If you come on a Friday, Saturday night, it's packed out, there's like a mariachi group, a trio, there's another part of Salon Tenampa which is like a, um, un saloncito pequeño, it's like another little room and the, the custom is, is that these groups will come up and offer a song and uh, you can ask for your favorite songs, you can sing with them and it gets very rowdy and it's, uh, it's a real taste of Mexico. Um, Salon Tenampa is really more of a cantina and uh, so we ordered a few things off the menu which uh, we hope are, are going to be good but <laughs> yeah because yeah. even the waiter said you know we're more of a cantina than a restaurant. But the thing here is to come and have a drink, a tequila, a paloma. He's having tequila, I'm having a paloma. So, salute, guys. Mm. Good. Ah, oh, that's strong. <laughs> <laughs> so, the first plate we have is a huarache de costilla. Check that out, my lord. A huarache is a thick tortilla base that can be prepared in many ways. This one is topped with salsa verde, sour cream, grated fresh cheese, onion and costilla, which is the rib. Recommended by the waiter and one of the most popular items on the menu is the molcajete surtido. Grilled steak, spicy pork sausage, chicken breast, asadero cheese, cactus and onions are drenched in salsa verde and served in a mortar and pestle base made of volcanic rock. Is it good? It's good actually. Okay guys, I'm going to try the huarache with costilla. Let's see how it is here. Mm. The meat is soft. And the huarache is really crispy. I like that. And there's nothing worse than a soggy huarache or sope. And it's really crispy underneath. Mmm, this is delicious. So we're gonna make 
our tacos from the molcajete. And the fun thing about this is you can choose the, the ingredients you want to have in your taco. Mmm. <laughs> How mm. mm. I'm surprised that it's very good. Like the yeah. quality of the food is really good here. Because the waiter, I mean, the waiter's not just trying to sell. He was actually being very honest. He said, look, we're a Clintonian. You know, we're not known for our, you know, all of our dishes. Uh, people, like, I think that the food here is more of a secondary thing because it's more of the ambience and the drinking. Um, but this is really good. One of the important elements of the molcajete is the grilled cheese. Queso asadero. <laughs> Panchito's gonna make a taco. Okay. Oh, do you Look at that. That is a mega molcajete taco. It's going to be amazing. I'm like... Oh, yeah. <laughs> right there. Boom. Boom. So, Mancho forced me to make this taco. But... Mm. So good. This is really good. This green sauce makes all the difference. Mm. All the meat and the chicken is like marinated with the meat. With the sauce. Yeah. The taste. Honestly, really guys, good. we're very surprised. Like this, the servings are very generous. Yeah. The seasoning is great. This is a very traditional Mexican flavor, right? Yeah. Exactly. Right. This is like what you would have maybe at somebody's home. The salsa, the way your mum would prepare a green sauce. And um, like I said, we're very, very surprised, but in a great way. Like, he just took another bite of the, the huarache. I feel like I'm, that's so all over me. He just took another bite of the huarache and he's like, man, this is so good. So definitely recommend this spot, not only for the ambience and the, the drinking, but yeah, this is great. The huarache and the molcajete. And it's very generous. Mm. Oh, whoa. Mm. Boom. Delicious. No puedo gritarlo. Ni quiero gritarlo. straight from Plaza Garibaldi in Mexico City, Salón Telampa, and we really recommend this spot. It's been fun. The food is delicious. Uh, the drinks are great. It's not expensive. I think um, uh, this would be the spot to come to when you're in Plaza Garibaldi. And because of the history, because it's such an iconic, legendary spot, I think this would be the place for you guys to come, experience a night with mariachis, a typical night with Mexicans because a lot of Mexicans come here, not just foreigners, come and drink where all of the Mexican legends at some point in time over the last hundred years came to drink with their friends. So till next time, Panchito. Thank you, Sandy, for inviting me. 
Hope to see you soon. And I'll be me soon for another video. Sure, sure. <laughs> so, till next time, guys, Chinita out. Subscribe to her channel, turn right. on the notifications, share the video. See you next time. Chinita out. <laughs>